Peter the Peacock is the March Madness mascot with an impeccable ability to fire up a crowd. From shaking his tail feathers on the sidelines to making snow angels at center court. What is the most wild thing you've done while wearing the peacock? I would say the dance battle against Kentucky's mascot. Emilio Ortiz is the boy behind the bird. It's just who I am as a person. I like to be energetic. I like I like to make people laugh. I think it was really just my vibrancy, and I really put that into Peter the Peacock. While the world is just getting to know St. Peter's as the school advances to the Sweet 16 on Friday, St. Peter's pride has been pulsing through Emilio's veins since the junior first stepped foot on campus. I was class president my freshman year. I created my own club here at St. Peter's. I'm a resident assistant and to some of the basketball players on the team. So it only felt right that, you know, I go with them. When school officials were looking for a mascot before the tournament began, Emilio flew into action. I just ran to my office and I was like, me, me, please send me, please send me. With minimal experience, but plenty of peacock pride, Emilio got the job. You're doing a lot and you're wearing a lot. I mean, what's it like inside of there? It's so hot. Like, it's like if you just took a shower and your face is sweating and you're really trying to, you know, maneuver it from getting into your eye. And when St. Peter took down Kentucky, it was Peter flying solo. No cheerleaders or band traveling with the team. But Emilio says it's all worth it. Just being a part of history just means so much to us as a small school in Jersey City. You know, most of us are minorities, uh, first generation college students. So we're really feeling this impact right now. It's so it's so prideful because we get to really represent our school. I asked Emilio what we can expect from Pete the Peacock when St. Peter plays Purdue on Friday. He says lots of wiggly fingers. It's their way of sending good luck to players making free throws. Hopefully the refs don't call foul on <laughs> Foul. F-O-W-L. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.